about to do. Uh, you're gonna be a little special, a little different. I'm actually in the airport right now. I'm about to head to Vancouver. So the next couple of days you're gonna see, there's gonna be a variety of different uh, good foods that we're gonna find in Vancouver. So are y'all ready? Come along with me for this journey. Let's go. First stop on the Vancouver food bucket list is Jaffa Dog. We just landed, it's like 3 a.m., it's rainy, it's cold, but you know I gotta get some Jaffa Dog. So I got three three different ones right here. I got the number one, which is, what do they call it? What is it called? Uh, Kuro, Kuro Buta Terra Mayo. I'm probably butchering it, but I'll put the name in the thing right here. Take a look at that. The beauty. And then we have this second one, which is the... Okonomo, Okinomi, with some Benito flakes in there. And then we got their the Wagyu Terry Mayo, which is right here. Obviously some Wagyu beef there. I'm gonna give them all a try and see how they are. I'll try, the, I'll try this one first, the Benito flakes one. Forgive the rain, sounds pretty bad. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, it's so good. So nice and juicy. You really get the nice smoky flavor of the, of the sausage. Mmm. Oh, the Japanese mayo, really good. Get a little bit of cabbage in there. Bonito place. Oh man. Forgive the sound. Oh yeah. What's the next one? So this, one, this has some seaweed on it, some onions, kupi mayo again. The Kuro Buta Terra Mayo. Mm. Oh, you see that? I got cheese in there. Wow. This is really good. Compare the two. Mm. Good. I like this one more because the onions. Giving it more, more of a bite, more flavor. Mm. Oh, oh, oh. And lastly, let's try the Wagyu one. That's a Wagyu beef there. Not only does it have the uh, Japanese mayo in there, it has another like teriyaki sauce in there. Delicious. This is the best one. The Wagyu one, by far the best one. Mm. A1. Definitely, if you're in Vancouver, definitely try the Amazing. Amazing. Very, very good. See you at the next spot. Let's go. up now we're at another spot we're at fanny bay's oyster bar i'm really excited to try the oysters they're not just they're not here just yet but we got some other stuff going on we got the fish tacos right here we got the tuna tartare i got mussels and clams over there so i'm gonna have the fish taco right here That's really good. That, that sauce is really nice and tangy, and it has a little bit of citrusiness to it. And the look of the lime, that's citrusiness, and <laughs> the fish is super flaky and very, very good. Very delicious. I enjoy it a lot. I tried some of the tuna tartare. Super, super. So I yeah, put a little bit of the tuna. Onto the chip, it's a little little tortilla chip right here. Look at that. A little bit. It's hard to get, bro. A little bit. A little bit of tuna tartare. Mm. I like that. Very good. Very good. 
very refreshing taste. Very clean, very smooth, very, very bouncy, very fresh. Enjoy it. We got a the muscle right here. And I got a clam right here. Let's try both. Let's try this one. Mm. Okay, let's try this one. I like it. And then try the muscle. Mm. It's very, very fresh. That's what I really like. Very straight from the ocean, man. Very delicious. Definitely tastes a lot better here than back home in Toronto. Than, you know, man, cool. Man, they got fresh seafood here. I really enjoy it. Now, can't wait for the oysters. Finally, the oysters are here. Check them out right here. Beauty. So we got we got two different ones. The inners are the northern northern bells, and the outside is the sun crystal. Sun secret. Sun seeker, sorry. <laughs> yeah, and outside the, the sun seeker. So we're trying one. Let's try the northern bells first. Check it out. We got oyster. Let's put a little bit of lemon on it. And I don't know what this stuff is. It's uh. A little bit of a uh, thing vinegar or something. Okay, let's try it out. Let's just try it out. Mm. That's good. Mm. Very, very buttery. Very nice. Straight from the yogurt. You can taste that. Vinegar gives a nice little tanginess to it. Lemon, really like it too. Citrusiness. Alright, so let's go in for the sun seekers. Here's that. Yeah. Here's uh, J2 in the car trying out the Jaffa Dog as well. J2 B little bonus clip. Hold on, I need, I need to document this. They both, uh, J2 and Brian, they both got also the Wagyu one, the one that I just tried. So I'm excited for them to try it. Turn on the light, the two lights. Yeah. All right. All right, cheers, bro. All right, bro. Cheers. Cheers, man. Let's try this out. Brian, what's the consensus? Mmm. Mmm. Look at the camera. Look at me when you say it. <laughs> this is really good. What do you think of it? Really good. That's all I got? The sauce? <laughs> the teriyaki sauce. Or whatever. Yeah. Some sweet sauce in here. It's really good. Quite delicious. With the mayo. Mm -hmm. J2, what do you think? Yo, um, we're gonna get a shot of this. So, I think this, the sauce really just like takes the cake, man. Like it, it's really, really good. Just the combination of sauces. Um, Man, personally, I don't really see where the Wagyu element comes in, but it still tastes really good. I'm not gonna complain. Uh, I, you know, I rate it. I would, I would definitely take another bite, like I will right now. Yeah. Solid. All right, let's get it. The casing of the sausage. Yeah. Is it hard? 
But it's very, it's, it's still juicy. Mm -hmm. Very juicy. Very juicy still, and then very flavorful. You definitely taste the smokiness of it. Mm -hmm. All right, let's roll out. Very nice. 